everyone, I'm Dawn. Welcome to my channel. Thank you. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Thank you for visiting with me today. So today I have a huge makeup haul. I'm feeling a lot better. I put some eye makeup on and some lipstick, but I didn't do my face because of this. So I'm just going to rub it off. So I have a ginormous makeup haul. And, um, so we're going to go through this. Some of the stuff I may have shown you in unboxings and stuff, but we're just going to collectively show everything I have because I have a lot of new stuff, unopened stuff. So I have this uh, makeup, makeup blending sponge set. I think it's so cute how it's packaged, but I got this in a BoxyCharm a couple months ago. I canceled BoxyCharm because... I was sick of skincare, but I do like these. I just haven't opened them yet because I have other ones that I'm using up. I like to use things until they're complete. Well, that's not always true, but like things like that, I like to use what I currently have until it's used up and then, you know. <clears throat> so, let's see. All right, I got this Ultimate Edit right here. These, because it, I, 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 at first I didn't like these because I thought, well, I don't want just a little thing of six colors, but then, um, I was like, well, that would be good to just like throw in a purse and this is warm neutrals. I may need to put glasses on at some point, but I like these little things. I have the Phoenix one that I've used a lot, so I went ahead and got this one too. And then I have a Revlon pencil in Jade and also uh, the Colorstay Micro Hyper Precise Gel Eyeliner with Smudger in, in black. Oh, it's brown. Oh, I'll still use it right here. Uh, I like mechanical pencils eye pencils, lip pencils. I like them to be mechanical. I don't like to sharpen anything. Like a lot of these will come with a little tiny sharpener at the end to just sharpen the tip. That's fine, but like pencils and stuff, because once I use it once or twice and it needs to be sharpened, I won't sharpen it. I just won't. Okay, now I've got this uh, NYX. <sighs> Damn it. NYX Shadow and Liner Primer right here. I've never tried this before. I thought I'd give it a go. And then I have the NYX Three Steps to Sculpt right here. I had the kind of wet and wild version of this and I like that a lot. And I'm like, well, I bet the NYX version is even better. I'm a big fan of NYX products. And then I've got the NYX Sweet Cheeks Glow. Let's open this one up. Oh no, it's tape shut. To open it up anyway. This is a blush. I don't really use blush very often, but I had a bunch of coupons. So there's the blush. That's pretty. I definitely wouldn't put it on that dark on my cheek, but that's pretty. A little tiny, tiny little bit of a shimmer to it. Then I have the Epic Wear Waterproof Eye and Body Liquid Liner in white. I use these a lot in some of my makeup looks I do for my channel, so I had to get that in white. White is good to, like if you draw a line of some sort, like let's say you're doing a scar and you draw a line and you kind of blend it out on the bottom then go over the top in the white, it makes it pop. Okay, I also, I got a Wet n' Wild Mega Liner in black. Um, these are also useful for those looks. And then I got two super fat eye markers from NYX. I've never used these before, but I've always wanted them and now I have some. And then I have the little Marilyn Monroe Hard Candy Palette right here. I sold one of these on Mercari and 
I got one for myself too. I don't know, this is really inexpensive for some reason. I, were these from the drugstore? I don't know if I got these from the drugstore. I have a friend that has a drugstore, like a, a, a small little local drugstore. He's rebranding it into doing just medications and holistic healing. So he's getting rid of all name brand things like makeup and stuff. So he gave me a ton of stuff, but I don't remember if he gave me this or if I got this for really inexpensive somewhere. Why can't I remember? Oh, well. Oh no, he gave me these. That's right, because I have all these too. Then I have the Hard Candy uh, Waterproof Volumizing Mascara and the Diamond Finish Mascara. And then I also had the Universal Red Lipstick. None of these have been opened, I'll need to open them. And I got this from a BoxyCharm, it's skincare, but I decided to keep this one. Moisture Boost, Vitamin Boost, Feed and Nourish and Vermin Mud Masky thing. So, maybe this will be good to throw in my bag. But is it just moisturizing? Maybe to throw in my bag for when I'm not wearing any makeup. And then I got this in my last boxy charm, my final one the Give Them La La Beauty little palette. This is a pretty cute palette. Right there. Really pretty colors. Um, I would definitely use all of those. Maybe not that middle color so much, <clears throat> but all of these outside colors in my regular makeup looks, I would use that. And then I like it because it's got a I don't want to blind you, but it's got a little mirror in it. I always like a mirror with my palettes. So that's that box. Let's move on. I have three box fulls of, of, of haul stuff. Okay, now this one, I, I grabbed this because I just thought it was really cute to maybe try to do like a festival clown look or something. Right here, it's just a little wet and wild thing, like $4.97. I thought, well, let's try this one because I've tried other ones like last year and the year before, I think, or maybe it was just last year. I tried black, purple, I tried the yellow one for child, um, Childhood Cancer Awareness Month, which didn't work out for me. I'm gonna try it again this year, we'll see. Um, what other color, did I try green? I didn't get green or blue, which I would like to get. The green is real pretty, but I saw the pink and grabbed it. Then we've got, and again, more NYX stuff, cause I love NYX. I got the NYX Ultimate Shadow Palette, and let me tell you these colors. And Ultimate Utopia, right here. I think those are beautiful colors. And then I also got it in warm neutrals. Something else good for my big makeup bag. And then the festival. I think this one's really pretty. So I have these three now. And then, uh, then the NARS blush, I got this in a boxy charm. You may have seen me open it up before. But I love the little NARS compact. It just seems so sturdy. And then a little mirror in it. But there's the blush. Still got the plastic in place. I'm gonna swatch some of these things for you. Some of them I don't want to open yet, but I'll swatch this for you. It's a very pale color. You know, I, I think it would, you know, lend itself to a very natural look. So I got that. I had one of these. For some reason, I got two of the same box. 
so I sold it on Mercari. Okay, then I've got this Iconic London Ultimate Bronzing Powder right here. <clears throat> I believe this came in a Boxy Charm too. And I like it because it has a mirror. I just haven't pulled the cover away from it yet. But there it is. I don't want to touch it. But I will. There it is. That's actually nice. I like that it's not glistening. Because sometimes I'll get a bronzing powder and then it turns out to be glistening. Or maybe it's just me. Then I have the NYX, I have several NYX lip products. Let me put these on so I can read them. The NYX lingerie, I don't know what color it is. Oh, ruffle trim. This here, I don't know, and maybe you know if this is matte or whatever, but I love lip stuff, so I got this. And I also got it in, oh no, this is lingerie push-up, long-lasting lipstick right here. And then we've got the NYX lingerie, what is this? I think this is a matte right here, this one. All of them are close to the same color. And then another lingerie push-up, I think it's the same color. I think I just got two of these. And then we have the Superstay Ink Crayon in, I think that says Lead the Way, and this is by Maybelline. I got this right there. Very nice color. I don't want to swatch that for you because this is such a nice clean point right now. And then we also got that Another Superstay ink crayon in, it's red, but own your empire right here. I love a red lip. And then, oh, this is a Wet n Wild. I thought that this would go good with this particularly this glitter. So. Then we've got the, this is CoverGirl Outlast All Day Custom Nudes Lip Color. It's a smooth, what is it? Okay, so there's a color coat and a top coat right here. I haven't opened it yet. But let's just open it just so we can So I get a lot of similar colors and then red. Okay, then we've got the BDB Billion Dollar Brows pencil in taupe. That's um, pretty universal color, I find, because with brows you can you can build them. So it's got a little spoolie and then it's very, very skinny. Good for probably sculpting out some brows if that's what you do. But that came in a boxy charm. And then I got my very favorite mascara in the world. Lots of lashes, great lash. <laughs> this is the best mascara in the world. Black is black. Ugh. And I got this in my last boxy charm, the Jekka Block Play Pots, vegan and cruelty free. So that's the packaging. There it is. It's a little gold. Uh, it's very pretty. But I believe this is for the eyes, cheeks, lips, just face. I think just whatever you want to do with it. 
I think that's what this is for. Yeah, it's cream pigment for eyes, lips, and cheeks. So, that might be useful for the childhood cancer look because it's gold. I might have to figure out how to incorporate that into that look. I don't like to use yellows and golds on me because I, I'm, I have yellow undertones and it just looks like healing bruises on me. I'm sorry about the glare for my glasses, but I need glasses to see. Okay, and then I've got the Benefit Brow Styler. I got one of these a couple months ago in a boxy charm, and I ended up selling it on Mercari, and then I went and got, <laughs> got it anyway. So, I haven't used it yet. But I love the packaging. We're all a sucker for packaging. You know, and there's that at the end. So maybe I'll whip that out and use it soon. Little information booklet with it. Oh, honey, you gotta get that literature. Okay, so the Carter Beauty stuff went, oh, I also got this too. Um, from Wet n Wild in that kind of purple. Like the other one was more of a shimmery. Well, this is more of a matte and this is more of a gloss color. So we'll see how those work. Those work. So anyway, the Carter Beauty stuff went on clearance. It was not popular at all. I, I think maybe they didn't get any advertising or something. So I got a lot of it. I got the palette, which I think is really pretty, but I don't know how it wears yet, so I'm going to do a video where I try this out. But I got two of them, and I figure if I like it, maybe I'll give this one away. You know what I mean? So keep an eye out for that video. And then I got a couple mascaras, After Dark Volumize and Mascara. I got two of these. And then... I mean, I don't even know who the girl is. Marissa Carter, maybe she's famous, but I got a lip color and then I got a lip gloss in this red. Is that a gloss? Yeah, that's a gloss. And the expiration is 24 months, which I love. And then I got a blusher. Let's open that blusher. It's a palette, so I don't know if it's more than one color. Let's see. I, I know this video is running long, but this is a huge haul. Uh, I don't like to rip these things. Come on. Oh, so it's a little blush palette. I'm not going to open it all the way because if I give that... Oh, look, it just flips open anyway. So, Uh-oh. So, that's that one it looks kind of orange uh, let's try this brighter one so yeah we got this little blush palette so that's the end of the second box let me get the third box and it's the last box okay so <clears throat> Every time I go to Five Below, I get a set of these because I think these are great brushes. I may, if I do a giveaway, I may get a set of these and give them away with that. And look, it matches, it's kind of purple. They always have different colors. But I may grab another set and give them away with this just so I can show someone else how nice these brushes are for the price. Five Below, you know. And then I got some of these at Five Below. I had some of these up in my Mercari shop. Then I saw they had them at Five Below, and I was like, oh, that's why these aren't selling. They sell them at Five Below. So it's Bella Pierre Natural Eyeshadow Set. It's three. It looks like they're loose. Yeah, they're loose. And it comes with a little brush inside. And I actually have two of the naturals, so maybe I'll give one of the naturals away, too. And then I got the romantic one, which is three 
little pot and then another brush. And it looks like it's just a single-ended brush, so. No, I don't like loose eyeshadows. I'm not really sure what motivated me to buy those. And then I got this Bella Pierre lip lipstick set. It's four matte lipsticks in the red range, so you know I love those. I love a red lip. And so maybe I'll do a couple videos doing looks with these, or I'll try. And then I've got the, y'all saw that before. Um, and then I got this brush at five below. I think this was like $2, but that's a nice brush. So I got that. And then I have a couple wet and wild brushes, but that's it. That's all I got. That box didn't have as much stuff in it. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, like I told you, it's a pretty huge haul. I got to put all this stuff away and, um, but that's it. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, keep an eye out on my channel for the giveaway. I'll definitely do a look with the Carter palette. And if I like it, I might do a giveaway with the stuff I didn't open, like one of the mascaras and the palette and a set of those brushes. So anyway, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for bearing with me while I get through this sickness. Um, I'm actually feeling pretty good today. I may get out of the house for a little while. Um, have a doctor appointment soon, so we'll determine if we can get rid of this. But that's all for now. Thanks so much for watching. I'll talk to all of you later. Bye.